have died. Bye. Many of you probably think that uh, the most viewed videos on my channel are the one regarding black metal. And I thought it too looking at this video with 1 million views. But this is not the most viewed video. Actually, the most viewed video is a reaction that I did two years ago about this drummer here. I don't understand how that video got 1.5 million, but I guess that you sick motherfuckers out there love to see people suffering. And I suffer every single time I see him playing drums. After that video, I thought I was done, but people started with, oh, you should see his videos with one hand, it's so good. One hand? Are you kidding me? So I make this other video where I cry loudly of emptiness but I thought okay that's enough it can't get better right but yesterday I got an email of a fan saying oh man you have to see those videos here he's so good I choose the best one for you they are not copyrighted it got even better than before how how he can get even better than before when he was already on the top of the tops so since this poor guy took time to find those videos you know and send to me we are going to suffer again we are going to die of Envious for the third time. This is a challenge created by one of the world's best musicians. Okay. His name is Jacob Collier. Never and heard he about it. it. with his five fingers. However, I only have four limbs, so we will have to work on that. Let's see how this goes. Let's see. Three, four. Bass drum. Six on the hi hat. Six on the splash. No, it's three on the splash plus. He's doing two things with one hand. It's three on the splash and two on the fucking on the second splash and he's doing five on the snare. What the fuck? Fuck! How the fuck you split your brain in five? That sounds. You you know when you uh, open two songs. The same songs, but you open it with two different programs, and one is further and one is behind. It sounds the same. How the fuck you can split your brain in one, two, three, four, five different things to do? 0.5% drummers can play this. What's drum patterns? Okay. It's too fast, I don't understand. It's like. Two hits on the right and. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> Water notes lead step five. Okay, there's steps. I lost the steps. You had me maybe at step one. Four against three. <laughs> no man, bull poly. You're you're a fucking you. You're savage. You're, you're savage. This must be illegal. Okay. I understand it. He's, the thing that makes me nuts is that he's doing two things with one hand. How his left arm, his left hand doesn't. He can't do it. How? How he doesn't get confused? And he seems so relaxed. Like it's nothing. Fuck you. The forbidden drum technique. What, what the fuck is doing there? Is having the. Is the. Is this drumstick that is holding under the one there or, or is on top? This was too fast. I need, I need to see it again. Show me again. Again! Again! It's on top. It's on top. It's on top. How the fuck you do that? Look at this hand! He's barely move his hand. It's all fingers. It's all fingers control. Holy! Fucking oh, shit. Oh. Hi, this is an Alessis multi -pack. First time playing it bass, like what this. the fuck is that? Okay. But if you ask me, the cool thing is the looper. You hit the right pad and whatever is sounding will continue sounding. And that abomination, I got no fucking idea what that is. But it sounds Me neither, like what this. the fuck it is? 
Okay. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on. Do you know, guys, how hard it is? Doesn't matter even if he learned the patterns with the legs before, it's still fucking hard. Right. I always wonder if he, if he do the trick with the stick and if he miss it, do we record the video again? My favorite drummer in the whole world taught me this exercise. Okay. Four, four, three, three, two, two, one, one. On top of that, we got the bass drum. Then of course, three, two, rumba clave. Total what the fuck, fuck is rumba clave? Don't believe me. Try to follow. Three, two, one. Okay. You do the same there. So when one do four, the other one do already three and stuff like that. Man, are you fucking kidding me? And you do singles with that thing there on your left leg that I don't remember it's called. that's how much it takes for it to fall on the one again. But again, it's just practice. My ass is just practice. You have to practice 25 years to do those kind of stuff. Uh, it's, it's not just practice. You have to be a little bit skilled, you know? If you don't have, it's like if you don't have any talent in drawing. Drawing? Yeah. You can become a Picasso. Doesn't matter how much you train. Has to be something. You have to be a little skilled. Or have a brain that function, actually. My drum solo. Ah, that floor tom. The inverted floor tom. That's genius. That's genius. The weights. The weight on the drums is there till when I reacted it at the first time two years ago. That's some freaking cool. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, shit. Those doubles. His fingers, man. Those fucking fingers are wild. Only 5% of drummers can play this. Are you in that 5%? Nope. Learn this with me. It just takes practice. Let's let me go. see. Let me see. Learn with this with me. I can do that. Okay. I can do that. Okay. I can't do that. I can't. I will suck with this kind of stuff. Are you asking me too much? Oh, you're hitting that thing on the with the left leg. No, man. Nope. I'm sorry. You guys see this? Is, these are the kind of stuff that I never learned in drums. I always learn just what I like. But if you want to succeed, you should play stuff that you also don't like or you don't listen. <laughs> the hardest the drum intro ah. ever. Why he has a? Guys, if you're not a drummer, do you know how hard it is? Because the bass drum is made for your feet. And it's not tense as the snare drum. So you have to put a lot of energy to make it sound with your hands. That requires a lot of strength. Which this guy has. Has a huge bicep. That means that he has the power. Has the damn power. You play it like it's so. <sighs> what, I, what, what can I say? What can I say that that that's everybody out there already know? Proof I'm a computer. Oh, here we are again with this uh, tripping stuff. makes me nuts because I, I can't get it I don't understand it's too hard just to look at it to understand looking at it imagine playing it guys th this is uh, these things make my brain tripping more than a Christopher Nolan movie seriously 
Tenant or Tencent or how fuck this cool is that movie is less complicated than that that is exercise. This is my bass drum top speed. Okay, let's see. Ooh. Oh, that sound, guys. That sound. That sound. You know what is amazing about all of this? First of all, he's he's fucking fast. I think that's uh, 220, 230 BPM. And the thing is that he doesn't have triggers. Faster you go with the bass drum, the less loud will be the sound. The sound here is loud. Just like when you play normal stuff. Oh. The thing is that if you use triggers and you make some errors, you can always fix that in the post, but you can't do it without uh, fucking triggers. He's so damn precise. And he's not using even a special technique with his uh, um, legs like a swivel or a heel to a nothing. Standard double bass drumming. Amazing. Nice song. Decapitated. Damn. My fastest uh, gravity blaster. Wait a minute. He's doing the gravity on the right hand. And he's doing doubles with the left hand. His gravity blast is so clean. He's so freaking clean. He's getting the fucking same speed of the gravity blast with the double strokes. Guys, the gravity blast is not the harder thing to do, but uh, to keep that consistency, you know? To keep the consistency. Especially at the beginning, you know? Well, attempting the worst speed record. Oh my fucking god! It's it it is going from single stroke to double strokes, like nothing. You can't even hear when it switch. Jeez. <laughs> <Woo -hoo! laughs> yeah, why not? Coffee. Why not? Jagger and my routine. How? Got it I can get the coffee, but free. the alcohol Go makes your out. muscle tired. <laughs> Let's die. Bye. Enough. 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 What you want me to say that I already didn't say in the previous video? What can I say is that this guy made drum videos fun to watch again. Because let's be honest, before he started, what you could find on YouTube was just simply covers. And when you see 2, 3, 10 of them, you get bored. You just renovate the entire drum things on YouTube. And that's why drums, I guess, become popular again. The only thing that I can say that uh, I really admire is work and dedication that he puts on this. When I reacted uh, to him the first time, he has 70,000 subscribers. And I can see now it's 3 million and something. How much it is? 3.72 million. That's fucking nuts. With that said, guys, we are at the end of this video. This is my last reaction to El Estepario. I hope you enjoyed and I uh, hope to see you all in the next one. Cheers! Satan. <laughs>